Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Billionaire Manny, and I I've been gone for a little bit, but it was not that long. It's like a month. Um, the reason I've been gone is because I started my masters, and it was kind of just like ah, for the first. So I just finished up my first course, and I'm actually finishing this week. I have a finals um, this week that I'm trying to prepare for. But I was like, let me just get in there and record a video for you guys. Um, so, for those of you who have been following me on Instagram, I did do good job. I have a lot to catch you guys up on. Um, it's not that I wasn't recording. It's just that I didn't have the time to edit and upload. So look out, I still have videos coming your way. And I just want to say thank you to my subscribers. Please, please, please follow me on Instagram. So that even if I, you know, don't post, you know, for a week or two, that you still know what's going on with me. And I'm looking here because I was... Um, please follow me on Instagram. My name is Billionaire Mandy on there. Um, I post my big chop, but I'm going to put pictures in here. I'm so excited. I was so nervous. I don't know what I'm going to call this video yet, but I just wanted to talk about it. So I chopped off my hair in, um, I didn't write the date down. It's crazy. January? It was like the end of January. Um, I cut it off and what I did, I'm going to put a picture in and show you what I did first. <laughs> So I pretty much cut it like really low and then um, I still had a little bit of relaxed ends left and then I washed it and while it was wet I cut where there was no like so this would be a how to big chop I wet it like I washed it completely and then when I was done I cut where the waves stopped so my hair was like this and then it started going straight so right where that wave started I cut that off but what I realized is from I'm over I'm about seven weeks um natural <laughs> you know part of the club now honey I'm not team left out anymore um what I noticed is that I still have relaxed and I've been clipping clipping you know here and there whatever but yesterday um I washed because the last six weeks I couldn't wash my hair um that's something that I'm still deciding what I want to talk about here on my channel. But anyway, on a happier note, um, I couldn't wash my hair. So yesterday was the first time I was able to wet my head. And I did not notice that there was some relaxed ends too. Like, I did a twist out and I usually wrap the ends. This time I didn't wrap the ends. So I was able to see, like, the parts that had relaxed ends. And I went ahead and clipped those off. And, um... So even though you do the big chop, I feel like you still have, it's not really relaxed. I feel like it's that part that was stretching out, you know, between, it's like between the, it's the transition point. So it was between the natural and the relaxed, like that in between here, right there. Yeah. But, um, absolutely love it. Oh my God. I think one of the things I was absolutely nervous about was how would I look? I have a big face and, um, I gained a few pounds over the last couple of months. It was warranted. And um, I was just like, oh my God, I've never had short hair before. Like, I mean, I've had a bob, but I'm talking about like no hair from here down. And I'm like, how am I going to look with short hair? And then, you know, like, I just, I just wanted to do it. And I just, I was tired of just saying, I didn't want to live my life just being like, I wish I would. I, I, so I like literally I woke up five o'clock one morning and I just cut it off. It was that simple. It was just like that simple. So I'm really happy I did it. Um, my mo my um little fro hawks and my afros be looking on point. What what what? I will insert some pictures of um you know where I am right now. Like the like the the. I will insert some pictures on, um, you know, a few hairstyles that I've done so far. Most times I just comb it out and I'll just put a headband on or like put the sides up into like a little mohawk. This is the first twist out I've done. Um, actually, my best friend came over and she twisted it for me. She, 
but I twisted, I retwisted the front because the front was too big, and it wasn't dry, and I had to go to work, so I kind of retwisted it and put it up in this little um ensemble. And so t tomorrow I'm gonna take it out, and I'm going to do a video tomorrow. I'll put that out in the universe. We are gonna do a video. Um, and I use I use the curling souffle from Shea Moisture. Oh my God. I am like so in love with Shea Moisture products. It's not even funny. Like I just really love them. It just looks like a gel. It's like a like a jello. That's what it looks like. So this smells really good too. That's what I have in my hair. Um, what else I wanted to talk about? I don't. My curl pattern isn't hasn't kicked in yet. My hair is just pretty much. I don't. It's not. Child, tell me why I try to do a wash and go. Child. I was washing and then them curls was going nowhere. I did the wash and go and I'm like doing it like they did in the video and trying to like come down and bring it down this way and my hair just wasn't curling up. It just did not look like how it looked in the videos. And I was just like, really? So my curl pattern really hasn't kicked in yet. I guess I have to like train my hair and continue to like curl it and stuff like that and you know it'll come in in time but I'm just really excited this is something that I've been wanting to do for a long time and I I'm actually surprised with my natural hair I always thought that my natural hair was gonna be super nappy because when it was natural and relaxed my hair was always nappy. like I have and y'all know I have I'm mixed with African and Negro like I have that 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 Nigerian type hair so and my hair is not that hard. Like, literally, like, I'll comb it. I just have to spray some leave-in and comb it out. And my hair is, like, it's not that hard. So I'm really pleasantly surprised with my natural hair. And I absolutely love it. I love, you know, like, embracing this new phase in my life. I have a few products to review. Um, I have a few natural products to review. I have a few other products to review. So please stay tuned. But I just really wanted to share my Big Chop story with you guys and tell you guys how excited I am. And for those of you who are um, on this journey a little longer than me, I am coming for you. I was like, my little, you know, bang right now. I was like, ooh, child, I'm going to have a, um, my bang's going to be by my eyes in like three months. Yes, honey. Let me show you. This is, I freshly cut it last night, so this is where it is. I don't really get, I don't get that much shrinkage, so that's what it is, and this is where it shrinks to. But I, so I guess... Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you watching, if you have comments, concerns, um, if you want to know what I'm using in my hair to wash it, the same type of products I use a lot of Shea Moisture and um, a little bit of Win, mostly natural products. So um, if you want me to do a video on that, let me know. And for those of you who are starting this journey, please let me know in the comment section what you're using, what your favorites are, um, and let's get a conversation going. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. Thank you.